Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to explain to you and introduce you to the new web part in SharePoint called My Feed. What is My Feed web part? Essentially, it's a new addition to a, a collection of web parts we have available in SharePoint out of the box. And the web part allows you to personalize a SharePoint page. Uh, what you see right now on the screen is the example of a company intranet. So you have Kind of the regular elements of it, you know, quick links and you know birthdays and Twitter feeds and news and events, um, uh, announcements, uh, all that stuff. But all of this is kind of information. Uh, all of the information you see here is kind of uh, the same for everyone. Uh, there is not, nothing personal, right? so it doesn't matter if I log in, if my colleague Mary logs in, we all will see the same information. My feed web part allows you to personalize. Uh, the information uh, on a SharePoint site on the SharePoint page. Uh, let me show you how that works. Uh, pretty straightforward. So let's edit the page. And I'm going to uh, add the web part right here. Let's add it. And it's called My Feed. Let's find it first right here. Here it is. And essentially, you know, this is it. Uh, this is it. Uh, and it shows you kind of the activity that is uh, related you know, to you as an individual. Uh, so let me actually first publish it just so that we can see it right here. And it tells you right here, this feed is personal to you, all right? So uh, essentially, uh, you know, depending on who is logged in over here, um, you know, each user will see a unique set of, um, you know, kind of updates. Uh, it's almost like kind of Facebook, right? And LinkedIn, it's kind of personalized. Uh, now, uh, the you cannot really control the information here. All right, you cannot really control what's been displayed, except for one little thing I will mention in a second. Uh, pretty much, my feed, you know, depends on the, um, you know, on the uh, sites you have access to and share with others. Uh, it depends on the sites you follow. So behind the scenes, there is some, uh, you know, logic and algorithm that kind of determines what you get to see here. So, for example, look at this. Um, it shows me, um, you know, that I guess I published some news. And there were some updates made by my colleagues, but again, I don't get to see uh, any of that. And you know, I can open particular documents that uh, those users, you know, for example, modified. Um, now, the only thing that you can uh, tweak uh, in terms of the presentation for your end users, uh, let me click on the web part and click the little pencil, uh, which will allow us to see additional settings. Uh, we can only control how many items. You will see, you know, all the users will see in the feed. You know, let's go for 10. And you can also control uh, the news posts, all right? So mostly it's documents that you will get to see, right, that others modified or you modified. But uh, if I disable that, then the news posts will, uh, you know, disappear, all right? Here we go. It just pretty much will be, uh, you know, uh, will be documents uh, and uh, non-news uh, items. So let me republish that. Okay, perfect. That's it. You look at this, we have uh, 10 um, items. We have 10 items appearing just like we uh, we asked it to be and then uh, no news posts uh, at all, all right? And if you want kind of to see the full view, uh, I just clicked um, right here, uh, see all, and it just kind of displays the full view, you know, of all the, uh, of all the updates. Uh, that's all there is to it. Um, it's um, you know it's very easy, obviously, to add to your site. Uh, not much configuration, but I think, in my opinion, it's a great way to personalize uh, your internet. Um, you know, so it's kind of a little bit more personal uh, and uh, unique to you know to 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 the user who is logged in. Uh, all right, so that's all I wanted to show you in this particular video. Hopefully, you learned something new. As always, happy to see you on my blog, SharePointMaven.com as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.